Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Cesar and I love The Sims 4. So guess what? We're starting a brand new series today. The Colour Spectrum Challenge. It's inspired by the Not So Berry Challenge, which quite a few of you should know. But this one is written by AB England. Link will be in description. Like a lot of the other Legacy Challenges, there will be 10 generations each with their own colour, traits and aspirations that they need to fulfil. But yeah, let's get on with creating our first heir, shall we? So straight away he needs to be a teen um, as he's run away from home from the orphanage, the foster care system. So yeah, he has undiagnosed kleptomania and he is also a slob because, well, right now he's a teenager. His lifelong aspiration is to be the public enemy. So that's going to be interesting to do as I'm normally goody two shoes. Let's see, he also needs to have some likes and dislikes. So just having a look at our um, bullet points here. So he needs to have photography skill mastered. So let's go into that. Also the mischief, because that's going to be helpful in the public enemy aspiration. And let's see. So I think of what the career has. I think handiness will help. So we'll go with that. So I'm going to do black as his like favourite colour, as he is the black gem. But. I'm not going to fill in any of the other likes and dislikes and just let him like figure it out for himself as we go along. Now with his hair I think I'm going to go for like medium length because I'm thinking he's just run away and like I don't think we'll do anything special with his hair. So I'm kind of imagining that like very stereotypical greasy hair like doesn't care what it looks like kind of situation going on. Uh, let's have a look at piercings. Actually no because he's a teen so later on. Oh yeah we just got this like select all button for like all the outfits. I think it's going to be very handy in the future. Okay so now I need to figure out like what his style is um, and oh yeah I made him like thinner because I felt like He's a teenager who's just run away, he's not got much money. In fact, they start with one simoleon in this challenge. And um, yeah, I, I felt like he would need to be quite skinny. But um, yeah, I'm just trying to figure out what style we're going to give him. But I felt like kind of the baggy, oversized clothes, kind of whatever he can find kind of vibe going on. And of course, he's going to be wearing these shoes. So they're basically converses and I feel like every single outfit's going to be these except the formal. And then with the formal look I'm going very simple because I don't think they're going to see it much. To be honest I think the same with active wear, he's not really going to be wearing it much so again keeping it basic. Found them basic converses again for this outfit. I'm not sure about them shorts. Oh, these ones are actually better. I like these ones. Can't forget socks because one time I didn't put socks um, on the sim and my chat was not very happy about it. Okay, onto his sleep hair. What the hell is going on here? Take off that hat immediately. And I always go for these bottoms to be honest because it's like nice and chill. So that's basically that outfit done. Okay, onto his party wear. I honestly don't know what to put him in. I mean, obviously everything has to be black. But like, what is his vibes? Shirt looks a bit too posh. That looks too casual. Mm, that could work. That could work. And then what trousers to put with it? Uh, just some basic jeans. And then of course, you know, it's the shoes. Onto swimwear. Why is he wearing a full-on top? Okay then. 
again just making it basic and uh, same with the hot weather um, kind of like this because like rolled up kind of look and then just the uh, basic shorts okay weather um, same shoes put them in a jacket and some just casual black things okay so here's all of the looks hope you all like this and I'm open for any suggestions um, obviously I forgot the socks so I'm now putting the socks on all of them so yeah, if you want me to change anything I can do but um, here's all the outfits a little um, display of them here um, and yeah I am putting him on the gallery just in case someone does want him but he he's pretty simple So just put in the description in, restarting the colour spectrum challenge, gen 1, black, simple as. Okay, and let's play. Um, I basically always do spring, um, and then it also says in the challenge to do it in apartments. So we're going to go to San Moshuno, I'm really bad at, at pronouncing things, so sorry if that's wrong. And I think it's this apartment is the cheapest. It's um, the weekly rent of 300. I think that's the cheapest one there is. And it's just got the needs TLC, so you get like broken parts. Um, and then you get it unfurnished. So here's our new apartment, very bare. Um, but yeah, let's get started decorating. Firstly, anything I can, I'm going to change black because once again, this is a black gem. But I'm um, not going to bother about the flooring because I feel like he wouldn't have the money to do that. Um, but yeah, let's have a look at this checklist. Okay, so I can have four lights. I'm going to go for these little tiny ones. And I think living room, bedroom, bathroom, and then like where the kitchen is going to be roughly is the best options for that. Okay, next is counters, which we can have four. Once again, make sure it's black and we're just going for the cheapest option, just to make sure we've got the four, what we're allowed. And then we can have a stove. So let's just put that there randomly so far. And also a fridge. Again, that's not where it's going to be placed, but that's where I'm putting it for now. Um, one toilet. Uh, what else can we have? Uh, we can have a tub, so a bathtub. Um, and I think also we can have the two sinks. So let's fit them in. Bathroom sink. And then the kitchen sink. Okay, on to the next one. Uh, we can have a bed. Beds are good. We can then sleep. And then a couch or sofa, whatever you want to call it. Go for the two seater so I can still nap on it as well. Because, you know, naps are good. And this cute little penguin TV. Look at it, it's adorable. Um, and of course, a rubbish bin. Yeah, let's go on and reorganize this kitchen because it's a bit chaotic. Okay, so put in them counters there and I always make sure that the fridge and the stove or oven, whatever you want to call it, are the opposite ends of the kitchen. So if there's a fire, you don't lose both of them. Um, and I was thinking later on when we get a bit of money, we can um, have that as like a kitchen bar stool kind of thing. Okay, so let's look at the checklist. Lights, one, two, three, four. Counters, one, two, three, four. Fridge, toilet, bath, two sinks, a bed, a couch, a TV, a bin, which I'm actually going to move here. And they've also got one in the stairwell, which is attached to the apartments. But um, we can use both of them anyway. So we're going to leave it here for today. And 
in the next video we will see what this teen gets up to.